What do you mean? The dwarf would burn if there wasn't a flingo. Oh, you mean for our other world? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, you could do it the old-fashioned way. Just let him roam free? No, 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 I mean, like, have a piece of stone wall that you usually tear down and then rebuild. Every time you want to yeah. get in. Or get out. It was grass wall because it's easier to tear down. Yeah, but grass walls can also burn, so that would, like, defeat the point. Every time you repair a stone wall, it heals it by 130 HP. So it would take quite a few hits for us to tear it down at this time. Every yeah, it's not going to be quite as fast, but you only have to go in there like once every couple of days, so. It depends, you know, do you want to dedicate another flingo to it? Is that worth the cost? Because well, the, the flingos aren't free either, right? There's quite a bit associated. With maintaining one. But what else are we going to be uh, using the other half of a uh, what's his name? <coughs> a uh, the bunny farm on. Wait, what? Remember we shared it with the bunny farm. What else could we put there instead of a bunny farm? Well, we could put pigs with the bunnies. Half pigs, half bunnies. Oh, I thought you liked having. Just a second here. You thought what? I thought you just liked having more pigs than bunnies. Uh, in general, I find them more useful, I suppose, yeah. That's why I made a... That's why we have a full area. I guess the thing is, I'd rather have, like, a compromise between pigs and bunnies rather than all of one or the other. Maybe. I'm not sure. Yeah. The thing is, as Musha, football helmets aren't as big a deal. So for, at least for this world, it doesn't matter yeah, as much to me. Any rush. I mean, meat would be nice, but eh. I've well, been doing pretty good so far, I think. Yeah. So I recently ordered a kilowatt meter, which is supposed to allow me to monitor my power usage. Now see how that goes. That, I'm a little bit more interested to know like exactly how much power my equipment uses, rather than just an uh, estimate. And still I have not found the atrium. Not good. Yeah, my meatball supply is running a bit low. Want me to go down to the caves and bring you some food? I'm not sure. Yeah, okay, you could. I, the thing is, I really don't know where I'll be. Like, I might just decide to pop up on top, because usually it's faster to get back to the base that way instead of traveling underground. Yeah. So all of the, like, if you're down here and you're looking around, all of the tentacle poles that... Remember we would have to be down there while you were loading the area? Yeah, but I mean, if, you know, you've explored a fair amount of the map, I think. Yeah. So if you're down here and you see an area that has a tentacle with the ground cleared around it, it means that I've already jumped to that and it doesn't go to the atrium. How was that? I think something just broke. Oh, my bunny helmet broke. <laughs> that could end in disaster. 
Yeah, it could. So here's the really weird thing about balancing audio. I don't even know if what I'm listening to is actually what's getting mixed for the final for like the stream. Hmm. Because it's kind of worrisome. Oh no! Okay, now I see it. So desktop audio is really low. Wow, I should turn that up. There. Yeah, so basically, in the panel, I have three different inputs. One is for Discord, one is for desktop sounds, and one is for my mic. So I'm able oh. to mix it there, instead of that three different volumes before it gets uh, mixed down to the final output. But then I also have a, my own mixer with uh, the audio interface that I have that I can adjust to monitor the sounds that I'm hearing. Uh, in my headphones, and it, you know, it, in other words, it doesn't correspond to what's actually being output on the stream. Just one of those things. You need to like, get used to working with that a little bit more, because when you do the stuff uh, in the recorded fashion, you can always balance everything out to make it sound right when you're editing. You re really don't get that chance when it's live. More bunnies. Wow, this is quite a village. Bon Mario. That must mean you're near the, pole, the uh, way up top. Yeah, I am. I'll check it out. I'm not sure anybody's been through here. It could be the one leading to Bee Queen. If you're talking about a sinkhole. Yeah, it's a sinkhole that I'm testing out. Okay. Uh, I'm in the killer bee area. Oh. Huh. Hmm. So I can get back pretty quick using the wormhole, can't I? Uh. That wormhole will take you to the, uh, mosaic. Yeah. It's probably the fastest chance I have. It's a perfect time to be down in the caves. Yeah, I wish I was sleeping right now. Why did you not get a full night's sleep last night? Yep. What happened? Dog woke me up. Ah, uh, that's happened to me. <laughs> Who has it happened to? <coughs> My God, I cannot for the life of me make this audio work. Okay, I think I've figured it out. I'm just gonna mute the game audio. What the heck is that weapon? It's, it's part of the mod. Uh. Oh, here we go. Character that can use it. Yep, only Musha can use it. If anyone could use it, they would be doing crazy high DPS.
Okay, so the game floor is about minus 40 decibels now. Could, could you guys talk a little bit? I want to adjust the volume for that. Okay, what do you want to talk about? Good, good. It's perfect. I can currently hear feedback. Wait, what? I was hearing myself speak for a few moments. Try it again. Okay, I am now speaking once more. I don't know why I'm speaking. There are 18 eggs in this fridge. Did you get any feedback that time? Nope. No. Okay, then I guess it's good. Up there. I'm thinking here. How could it be routing it back in? Oh. Yeah, okay. I think I might. I don't think it's possible now that if you hear any feedback, it's going to be me. Okay. Yep, I'm not hearing it. Okay, I wanted to get more food. Here we go, Raisin. Okay, the, that'll top me up for up here. Then there's also the sleep issue. I probably will craft another tent before going back down. That really did help. Yeah, I told you making another tent would help you. I what? I give the bird the dragon fruit, but only get one seed in return. Yep. It just always happens to me. It's uh, a. I never do farming. It's a twenty percent chance of getting another seed. So it's for risk-seeking indiv individuals to play that lottery there. Good. There are seven farms, so I had seven dragon fruits. It took me six to get enough to refill all the farms. Meaning the profit was one dragon fruit. Yep. Not worth. Uh, Drosh seems to like them. Yep. Oh yes, also pick raisin. up the books. Yep. Also raisin, do you see what I'm doing with the farm? You put the walls around it. Is it for the gobblers? Nope, it's for the, the uh, what's its names? That's not really helping me. The, uh... The birds. The geckos. Blech, I was blanking on their name for so long. Oh, okay. Thanks. I'll make it into meatballs. I mean, a bird flies down, it gets frozen by the farm, so I'll take the meat. This meatball I'm claiming for my own. Never look a gift a morsel in the mouth. Woohoo!
Do we have front yet? A, a butt pun in a chest. What's something? Okay, we need the. Wait, no, that's not right. There They're all in here. Yeah, I was looking for an item in my crafting that required rot. And Mushroom farms. Okay, the thing that came to mind to me was the booster shot, so I was looking for oh. it. Oh, actually, I should uh, take a snooze here. Because I was planning on going back down, and right now I'm tired, so. Probably the best bad ideas. Farm's almost uh, completely sealed in. Oh, it has a ways to go yet. But yeah, it's getting there. Only it needs doors and like a few more walls. So, Josh, did you do anything for your birthday? No, my parents took me out to the state steakhouse. Oh, that's nice. That was kind of it, because, you know, it's Tuesday and I had school. I guess it's better when it falls on the weekend then, huh? Everything's better when it falls on the weekend. <laughs> what about testing? <laughs> Probably not. Yes, yeah, some schools actually mix people test on the weekend. Must be for high achievers. I just it seems like an easy way to burn out. That's why I found it difficult to like make a video every day. It's like even one day can be a significant difference in how, yeah, your mindset about doing it. Just one day break and you press it, approach it with a fresh mentality. Mm -hmm. But uh, teachers and schools have been pushing students more and more over these ye past few uh, years. Well, in a world that becomes increasingly complicated, it becomes necessary to learn more. To keep yeah, up with it. Yeah, but th they're also cutting out other classes, like handwriting, English, even the... the uh, even cursive they don't teach anymore. I thought that was the handwriting. No, just how to write in general. Right, like print? I, I've never yeah. understood the difference. Well, my, my, old, uh, my old elementary school, I check back at the uh, website of my old school sometimes. They've gotten rid of their handwriting classes and replacement for typing. Yeah, that's what schools are doing. Why is like, that a I bad thing? In, today, in today's day, learning how to type is important, but like, I think, think about right is a bit more important too. So yeah, imagine not being able to sign your name. Hmm? It's funny other people have brought that up to me as well. Um, I'm a little. Uh, my position is a little bit different because you really don't need to sign your name. Uh, you can like put an X even, and most people take that as a signature. The interesting thing about signage is it just needs to be slightly consistent between what you normally do, like like a call sign, I guess. In the past, it's historically been your written signature when I say written I mean like in cursive <coughs> but that's really never been mandated I don't think and you can sign just about anything like you see authors sign books <laughs> like they'll do a book signing you're not gonna get cursive you're gonna get scribbling so no I, I'm a little bit curious though you're saying that regular print is being phased out yeah now that does surprise me a bit um well because even though typing is quite pervasive it still seems to be valuable to develop those motor skills for printing because 
I think it's a bit like learning a language to begin with, where if you don't develop it at a younger age, it becomes much more difficult to pick it up. Oh, it's glom glom thing. What is the Chester down here called? It's Hutch. There we go. I found the touchstone down here. Oh, here we go. Another tentacle. How did they not call them tentapoles? That just seems like the perfect, you know, pun. And since Clay is very punny about the way they name mobs and whatnot in the world, why, why would they overlook that one? I don't know. Because, I mean, what is it right now? Let me see here. I just walked past it again. It's like the pillar or something. Tentapillar. You know, it's called wet big tentacle. Big tentacle versus tentapillar. I don't know. I just like tentapillar better. It sounds so much... Yeah. So much more in also, line with what Clay does. Yeah. Also, when Joss examines Musha... He basically, uh, it, she's a weak force, but seems going to help us. Because he's Wolfgang? Yep. Turns out I need to save Hutch. What do they need to put in him to make him fearsome of spear and a, a light bulb? Spear and light bulb, yes. Okay. So we they... put a one-man band in him and giving him a huge sanity order of 30 per minute. <coughs> How long does the one-man band last? Like, I say about a day or so. Okay. Yeah, I never use it for anything anyway, so that'd be an interesting... What is it even used for? It makes it so you can tame pigs for free. Pigs will follow you while you, well, followers, I think you can also use it on bunny men. Never used it for that, but anyway, it'll cause them to follow you without you needing to feed them anything. But I it, thought it was just a joke item to know your friends with it. Well, it, it comes at a pretty big expense to, or cost to sanity. Yeah. Yeah, sanity loss, IRL. Recently, there was something that I was looking for. I couldn't believe I c you can't find like a consumer version of it anywhere. And that is basically a little camera that you could just, you know, attach to like the bill of a cap. Now, I don't want a huge honking GoPro, right? But like for doing uh, like little like work on something, it'd be nice to like record the process of doing it, like whatever it is you're looking at when you're working on something. Uh, while, while being able to do it hands-free and I just could not find anything that was capable of doing this and it really baffled me uh, Most of the stuff that is available is like really seedy kind of products from you know Chinese imports So they're like $20 or something, but there's like no Nobody makes a camera that small apparently it, which confuses me because like they have these really small cameras and phones all the time yeah, Obviously the technology is there like, give me one, let me pay $200 for one. It is due to the fact the cameras on phones aren't as good as the big bulky cameras that are just cameras. 
Of course, but I'm not. Like, I'm looking for something that's better than something I, I get off eBay for $20. Um, it doesn't have to be as good as like a DSLR. It just needs to be better than a $20 eBay pin camera kind of thing. Well, here's the uh, honestly, it's starting to come to that time where, like, technically a cell phone is what you're looking for, as cell phone cameras. Are yeah, but it's more and more it's cool. too big. I don't want like a whole cell phone strapped to my face to record something, or a GoPro. Like, this is my this was the problem I was having. Uh -huh. GoPro and cell phone are both or mobile phone, smartphone, all too big. <coughs> yeah, but here's the thing: no one wants those because GoPro is good enough for them. Yeah, I guess so. It's because that a company won't make something that people won't want, that people don't, I mean, people aren't asking for. So as long as people aren't asking for a smaller camera, they're not going to make it. Yeah, I just want something a little bit more discreet. GoPro is too... It's too Only boxy and in the way. Yep. At least for that. Because I do some other stuff, and I thought it'd be interesting to like at least record the footage of it. I'm not saying I'll release any of it, but it'd be nice to have the option to putting hardware together, stuff like that, doing DIY repairs of things. Oh yes, I forgot Hutch how annoying it is to have him around spiders, because he trips them all. Hooray for Hutch. <laughs> what is this? It's like a little paw print on the map. Yeah? Oh, it's a treasure. You can dig it up with a shovel, and there'll be goodies inside it. Usually beef wool and beard hair. And sometimes lots of mandrakes. Actually, we haven't been getting mandrakes as of late. I've heard. There's actually another one right next to base. I'm gonna go grab that one then. That's a base. No one right by base. Oh. Wow, there's one by Big Pig King. I think we're exhausting the loot pool uh, raising. What because do you mean? there is a finite loot pool for Mush's chest. Oh, I did not know that. What does it look yeah, like? I got some, I got some yeah, it's starting to give me just fool of sight now. Go on, Josh. Josh. I got some glow dust, five blue gems, and eight gold nuggets. Yeah, that's the most common thing when the pool dries up. It just starts giving you that. And and a tuna, apparently. Equip it in your hand and right-click it. That's how you open it. It's a food item. It just has fish inside it, though. Oh. Which is one of the things... One of the few th foods you can eat raw. Yeah. Or few meats. The meat-type things. Because uh, usually fish is safe to eat raw. You can eat regular meat raw, too. I honestly hate fish in real life. <laughs> Wait, you hate the little ones that swim around, or you just hate eating them? I hate fish and, like, as food. Okay. Uh, just just seafood in general, I hate it all. So, it... so fish are friends, not food. <laughs> I was just gonna bring that up. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Lotus. Oh yeah, also I got a crystal candy out of that chest raising. And you thought it was drying the pool up. No, no, that's what happens when the pool dries up. You stop getting beefalo wool and mandrakes, and you start getting higher tier items. Oh, that's actually a good thing then. Because we don't need the mandrakes. Yep, they're just easy level ups at the beginning for the most part, I think. Thank you.
But now we have seven Thulesite walls. That much Thulesite, huh? Oh. Yep, just seven walls. Are you gonna also use them for another, something? Also another crown. Eh, probably not. We also got another crown. Yeah, not much good junk. I think mine is ready, but I'm down here in the caves. Yeah, and you don't want to go hunting for in the caves. I mean, you could, but it's more annoying. Okay, I think I have another yep. tentacle spotted. Also, we have over two stacks of blue gems. Now, what are you gonna use them for? I don't know. I don't know. Blue staffs for everybody. Could work. Oh, the spider war going on down here with tentacles. So many spiders. Spider war, spider war. In the swamp. And hey, what is this song called? I can't tell because it's off to this side. It's called Firefly? Now, how did I get out of that without getting killed? Because I'm walking in circles. What is that game that Rickety wants to play? Have you tried it yet? It's like a free to play Battle Royale game. Mm. You haven't. Oh, he hasn't said anything to you about it. Darwin Project, I think. Oh yeah. Yeah, I've not tried it yet. No. Also, Josh, you can't hold any of Mush's items. I mean, I can. It lets me hold it for like half a second, and then it automatically <laughs> drops it. Yep. And that, and I could hold it in the inventory, but that's kind of it. Yeah. See, eventually you come to that realization that things are never getting better. And the, you know, as I'm walking around, because it's never going to be daylight down here. Luckily, I didn't get Hutch killed. But, oh my god, though. The light is so bad. Nope. You mostly just tank and spank at this point. This Besides, is where we make our final stand, Josh. Tooth traps are annoying to repair all the time. What the hell? Whoa, More charge! Whoa. Get in there! Oh jeez. <laughs> it's always funny. When I start attacking the actual tentacles instead of the baby ones, and then I'm standing there taking damage as if it's, it's baby hell? tentacle Oops, damage. Puppy. Okay. But yeah, now you get Wolfgang's quote with help you. I wonder if it's, if like the tentacle cheats and spawns it. Nah, I wouldn't do that. We're just unlucky. Yeah. I'm getting too conspiratorial about it. Okay. It wants you. It, it's another thing to help you fight. Think of it as a summon. I mean, not a summon, a follower. Wow, talk about timing. 
As soon as I moved to a different window to adjust something, a tentacle pops out and starts slapping me. <laughs> and suddenly, tentacles. Yeah, let's test this one. Maybe we'll get lucky for a change. Ah, <coughs> <sighs> we're in here. This is the also, one. Um, what? You you found it. Yep. Turns out I should not have dug this stuff up. Hmm. I'll have to find some other turf to replace it with. Yeah, so it's over here in the swamp. Guess weren't, things weren't as bad as I thought. What does a frog oven do? It's good for batch cooking foods. Like, uh, here. If, you, if oh. I do this, it can cook stacks at a time. Uh... I like how they reuse, like, the thing for the chimenea and shipwreck. And just made it a frog face. Yeah, but technically they just reused a pre-existing design. Yep. And technically they used the tent shape for this. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I don't see that, but... See, it's a pyramid shape. <laughs> Illuminati confirmed. Mm. Tall pat! Tall pat! Why are we using top hats? I just noticed Wash has a top hat on. Oh. I'm not Josh. I mean, get Josh. <laughs> yeah, that happens to me too. Your names are a little bit similar there. Almost too similar. I mean, my actual name is Joshua, but... And so it begins. The pain of not being able to hit a butterfly. Wait, this is your connection that bad? No, I just have trouble hitting butterflies. <laughs> Try to look for the shadow. Like, see where the shadow is on the ground and stand on top of it. So the big question is my, like... My, my friend laughs at me all the time whenever I try to kill butterflies. See, maybe it's just a psychological problem, then. It's more like I think I could just hit it, but it's, like, always moving, so I just end up chasing it down to swing at nothing. Yeah, you're... Even people who are good at hitting butterflies are not going to hit them every single time when they swing. How's it going, uh, T-Footballs? We are just doing a more laid-back thing. Most of us here are a little bit tired. And get either get that or getting over sickness. So apparently there's nothing else in the swamp. I'm just looking for like the nearest exit out of here. So that way, when it comes time to come back down here for the atrium, we don't have to spend a lot of time walking through nonsense. But uh, there's just like a bunch of bees over here. All right, they're the ones that lean let go. I think. No, they're trying to get back into their homes, but they can't pass fine because the walls are too close. Oh, it's those. Okay. Okay, it looks like the nearest exit is in the green mushroom biome. If I don't starve to death first. Not really. I've got six meatballs with me. <coughs> I 
I just, I'd like to run compressors on everything, actually. It'd make levels so much easier when it comes to mixing. Like, just squash those signals down to, like, a consistent decibel range. Oh. You wouldn't have to worry about it for every single game you play. Every new guest. Audio compressors? Audio compressors are beautiful things. I bought one for my microphone. I haven't enabled it yet, though. I should. It must be because of the uh, equalizer. I'm not really familiar with how to set a graphical equalizer, so I was just going to read up on that first. But basically what it does is it takes your highs and your lows and it squishes them together so that way you pretty much have a consistent audio output regardless of whether you're whispering like this or you're yelling at it. So it, it's much easier to balance the audio levels then. And that's like an issue that I have. Okay, this one leads right into the middle of the desert that's furthest from us. <laughs> that's the fastest way we can get there. Uh, I'm gonna put a rabbit trap by just so we remember which one it is. But yeah, hopefully there's a better way to get over here. There's just like four bats that are constantly surrounding Chester and fighting. Yep, because uh, someone opened this uh, sinkhole. You're hypnotized by Chester's beauty. There really is no fast way out of here. There's no wormhole over here in the savannah. The nearest one is in the other savannah. You could take this, uh, wor this, uh, thing. Yeah, but that would, uh... Or, or this one, and that's a uh, quick way to base. Yeah, Half wait, both of, both of them are. Oh, yeah, you're right, okay. Yeah, so do you see where the rabbit trap is? I'm not, probably not. Yeah. I put a it's little ping by the walrus camp. Yeah. So that's how, <coughs> that's how we can get to the atrium. Uh, it's most well, the closest thing to the atrium. Closest oh. exit. Uh, we're back. Oh. I think you cleared out this paw print here. Did you clear all the paw, the paw prints? Uh, no, I was going to get some more wood before clearing any more. Okay, because I, like, I see more on my map, but I'm not sure if they're all just out of date at this point. In which case, I'd be disinclined to bother with them. Yeah, just to walk normal speed at this point, I'm actually using the bunny helmet with the light on, on it. Yeah, that's painful about Musha. The less sleep she has, the slower you go. Yeah, this is how slow I'd go normally. Oh. It is the worst. <laughs> like you're lugging around the statue? It's not quite that bad yet, but it's getting there. Are you familiar with no copyright sounds? No. Like royalty free stuff? The channel. Oh, no. Yeah, they, they have uh, music that you can use. It's royalty free, basically. You don't have to pay anything for it. Providing you're not like a business or something. Or you're, I don't know, what do you want to, whatever it is. When you're just doing stuff on Twitch or YouTube. I suppose some people, for some people it is a business. Uh, maybe it's more like for businesses with a certain number of employees. Gosh, <gasps> but I only have 30 sandy right now. I'm not Josh. I... Maybe we could oh. get you, a, get one of you a different nickname.
So I need to get myself a nightmare amulet. Or level up your sword even more. Oh yeah, because then it can eventually teleport me? Yeah. Hmm. I think that'll take a long time. What level does it need to be? It has to have, uh, like, level... Like, level 25, I think? I'm level 26 with it. Oh, then I guess it's 30. Okay. Or to be level 30, it needs 400 points. I mean, 4,000. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't really tell me what the experience is for it, I don't think. It does if you uh, put fuel into it. Okay. Okay, let's try that then. This is lucky points times 51. They don't let it stay on the screen long enough. 12,543, I think. Is that possible? What, how many did you say I needed? It has to be, uh, 4,000. Wait. How come I... Maybe I'm just looking at the wrong number, then. Because it says GP. 12,000 some number. 668. Six, you know what that means, then? Uh, give me a moment. Seventy-eight. For me, it says, uh... For me, my uh, level uh, 21 is uh, 1,654. It's the bottom number. Yeah, I'm looking at the bottom number. For me, it's 12,000. Do you not see that? Do you see it what on me? Is it? No. You, you don't see that text that comes up? No. Oh, okay. Um, what level is it? it? It doesn't say level when I do this. I uh, equip it. Okay. Level 27, it says. Yeah, yours has less XP than mine. Wait, can you teleport with yours? No. How, how much XP does mine have, though? Pass me it, so I can check then. Um, okay, I'm in the tent at the moment. I, I'll just jump out of here. Alright, all the tree guards are dead. Thank you. Cool. I see how it would be broken if I could use those cool weapons now. 2,758. Okay. It's great that they hide all that information from me, I guess. I think you're just reading it wrong. What, is there like a decimal that's hidden? No, there's no decimal. Well, I'm sorry then, it just says 12,000. Yeah. Simple as that. Let me, maybe I'll take another look at it when I get back up. <coughs> No problem, T footballs. Glad to have you back. Be reading the bracket. I was looking at the number that was on the bottom. There's brackets. Oh. Oh, okay. I didn't know what that oh. meant. Oh. Get joshed. Um, I can despawn you if you want to come back as Musha. <laughs> okay, let me drop all the stuff. Okay. It, there's a bracket uh, between uh, the things. It's a, there's a bracket after the star. That's what looks like a one. Okay, go. Oh, okay. Okay, just a second here. I'll re despawn you. Oh. Pass out again. Oh, get Josh. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> Oh my god, why can't I get past that fence? <laughs> it's frustrating. I guess. Yeah, there's a bracket if you look at it. Do we have map scrolls? It doesn't look like a bracket. Uh, bracket. On my end, it does. No, it looks like an 88 now for me. Oh, okay, I get it now. The one. What I thought was a one in front of the numbers, actually, the bracket. Gotcha. Yeah, it's the, uh, how, uh, 
the uh, font that Don't Starve used that makes yeah. brackets look terrible. Okay, I got it now. So it looks like it has 2,800. Yeah, 2,850, let's just say. So what, how much XP did you say it needed for me to teleport with it? 4,000. Right, yeah, that's probably not happening anytime soon. I mean, if I go mining, I could power level it. Um. Hello. Dig it. Can you dig it? Holy crap. What's going on over there? I got, another, I got a backpack blueprint right off the bat and a garland. Pick up items off the ground. You might want to pick up that glow dust real quick. Oh, look, you got a backpack already. Oh, you dug up your chest. I take it. I also got a hammer, axe, and pickaxe, two gold, three tuna, Jesus. Yep, that's the Mush's starter kit. See, this is when the names above your heads comes in really useful because you both look kind hey, of I'm... similar. Hey, well, at least I'm wearing something that he doesn't have. Yeah, that's true. Oh, here. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna make Why the nightmare it? amulet and then go down to the. Oh, I can't even. E it won't even let me email now. <laughs> oh, yeah. wow! I forgot about that. <laughs> Just a <the> wheel. <laughs> you have to I'm type. type in the crap now. <laughs> Yeah, thankfully there was IntelliSense on it, so it's not that big of a deal. Alright, you can just start typing in what you think the command will be, and they'll give you options to yeah, choose. Yeah, I'm happy that they added that. <laughs> yeah, they made uh, spawning and stuff so much easier, actually. Or just taunting. Oh, for me, it was useful for the spawning because a lot of the names are not always what you think they would be. Like, maybe they'll have an, a, oh. a plural on it instead of just being singular, even though you're spawning multiple ones. Guess what? The treasure in here, inside this, like, enclosed pig house... ...is ungettable. Yeah, you can't dig it up because the ba it's right on top of basalt. Um, annoyingly, so the game is like, oh, you can click on it, but no, you can't dig it up, well, sorry. Will, will just walk infinitely into the wall in, a, in hopes to get it. <laughs> yep. I want it. I want it. I want it. Also, look how much health and sandy she has. <laughs> you get more as you level up. You start off with, yeah. what, 80? 80 and 80 sandy. I don't think I actually crafted the Nightmare Amulet on this game yet. You must have. No, uh, that was, uh, what's his name? Josh, I think. I didn't. Josh. Not get Josh. <sighs> okay. Eileen, do you have any Nightmare Fuel? Yeah. I need, well, like, I two. Snake, Where do we need that? Can you spare me too? Yeah, I'm coming back to base. Oh yeah, okay. What you do with the phoenix egg? Uh, Aline probably knows. I haven't never it's done anything a, with it. It's a pet. If you have to buy a fire, it becomes a, uh, basically a mini Chester. Though it consumes food at a very fast rate, so I don't like using it. Is something supposed to happen? I have a command called call lightning. You yeah, you can call it, it on yourself, enemies. It does nothing. It does oh. nothing if you call it on yourself. Try calling it on some enemies. No, no, he's talking about the right click one. The smite. Yeah, it hit. And he's not leveled up enough to use uh, lightning yet. Oh, oh, wait, what the heck? Okay, what is this purple meter? I have no knowledge of any of this. Okay, one. She requires sleep and also has mana. 
<coughs> How come there's no sad emote? What? Like, there's a happy emote. How come there's no... It's cry, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Do you have the nightmare fuel yet? Yeah. Ooh. Thanks. Look, y'all. You just ate glow dust. Yeah, I have a stack of 40. <laughs> That's really weird. What? You're starting to glow from the glow dust. Yeah, apparently I dropped some resource that I wasn't aware of. Okay, I'm gonna give it back to you just as soon as I make this. Oops. Oh, and I also need to make more food before I go down. I'm supposed to make this stuff. What? I don't know. Is there supposed to be like a special crafting station that I can make nope. this stuff? Nope. Just say crafting tab, where you craft everything over here. There is a special tab for Musha, it's called Musha, on your crafting menu. All of our unique items are in there, and you just can craft them over here, either at the Alchemy Engine or at the Shadow Manipulator. Oh, uh, I thought... Oh, okay. I thought I had to go, like, somewhere else. Ah! Sanity! I need Sanity! I think we need to go and... make some more food. I like how they had to give something infinite durability, so they just set it to 1B plus 50. <laughs> now I remember, you can still break. I remember when I was I remember when I was like little, I used to type in like nine 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 times nine 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 on a calculator. I would get that one B. E. So but yeah. you know that that is a lot. <laughs> yeah, G it has the same durability as say um what's its name? As uh marble armor. But it doesn't have as much durability, um, defense Protection. in the beginning. Oh, wow, you're so fast, it looks like you're glitching out. For me, you're not on my end. No, I mean the way you're moving. Oh. Looks unrealistically fast. <laughs> running along at the speed of sound. This is running around at the speed of sound. Hey, we're trying not to get copyright, <laughs> copyright in here. Only Frisk is really wor worried about that. <laughs> I've been <laughs> That's fascinated. The joke I was making. It's because a lot of Twitch streamers have been getting taken down as of late. Oh really? I haven't heard about that because I, I try to keep up on some of the news, but I suppose it's a little bit more official news. <coughs> Wait, like, what kind of music are they? Like, just regular playlists and stuff? Like, uh, just saying references or like, like any music that goes on for more than 60 seconds from what I've heard and seen. So I guess the days of streaming it like it's radio are over. Unless you're a music company like, uh, Monster Cat. Yeah. But they, you know, they make, or they produce, publish I suppose is a better term, publish their own music. Yep. Yeah, I suppose Monster Cat's like another version of NCS. Does Monster Cat actually allow you to use the music though? I'm not so mm -hmm. sure. They might be one of those that you can stream like stream their music d during your gameplay and whatnot. Uh actually I think you need a license for that. For Monster Cat? <coughs> yeah. Okay. Then they're not like NCS. I've heard of them, but I haven't, like, looked at what their policy is. I was on my way to get some more tree guard, not spiders, and then I was interrupted by tree guards. Oh, I thought you were going to go get people a wolf for your tree. No, no, no. Something has to be done about these spiders. Oh, I thought you wanted to leave them there to kill the beef. Yeah, and then I realized that I actually needed food. Where's the beef? I suppose we could try cutting beef for him. I've just never been very good at the timing of it, and so it ends up wasting a lot of time trying to get them in sync. But then again, I suppose standing here hitting spiders is not going to help me any. 
Okay, stop it. Just. I might just bring. Bring all the spiders out. Music ready? Uh, I don't think it really helps when there are this many spider dens around. Oh, I thought you want to be. Since they're not in heat. Uh, okay. I mean, originally I planted the spider nests to deal with that. The problem was that. They were too small when the beefalo were in heat, and now the spiders will never attack the beefalo. Mm -hmm. Actually, there is a way to do that, but it requires taming a beefalo a bit. You attack with a beefalo. Oh, you have to ride one? Retalidate. Yeah. Okay, let's try this. This sounds interesting. I want to do no, it now. we don't have a saddle anymore. What Do happened to it? Gold? Yeah, it we got a take... chest full of them. Yeah. Yeah, I already have those. Then we have no more gold. Right. Wait, how much gold do you need? I mean... What is it? I want to make the Phoenix Glaive, but that takes 30 gold. I'm at 29. Oh, wow. I forgot. Does it really... That does cost a lot. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, these fences are annoying me. Every time I run through there, I run into one. <laughs> Find and destroy them. Mm. You want to put the farm there. Yep, I'm not blaming anybody but myself. Well, actually, I kind of am. I'm not the one to put the fences around it. But, uh... There might be some stuff here to trade in with Pig King. Yeah, there's uh, marbles and mismatched buttons. So, I'm here for something, and I promptly forgot what it was. I was make, to make a saddle. Why do I hear boss music? What? That's probably Aline. Aline's like boss music. music. Oh, I see the problem now. That saddle is not cheap. Because we don't have you any other that resources. That? No, it's Aline. Aline's the one who did it. Oh, it's a birch nutter. Well, it's a some of the birch nuts. The angry little squawkers. This this character makes no sense. Get your ass over here, beef. Okay, I have a new idea. Time to bubble up. <laughs> Beat him up with the pitchfork! Yeah! No, 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 I don't have the pitchfork anymore. There, one down. Actually, two down. Okay, now I hear the music of when Woody is a uh, wear beaver. Still the same stuff though. Cartridge messing with the music. You can turn your music off. If you want. I like the music, I just I'm not I I wasn't expecting it to be all over the place like this is. I suppose it takes some getting used to. Clear out that herd? Not much of it. Mm. Oh, I'm going for another treasure. Come on, quickly kill it. Kill it! No, no! <laughs> yes. Oh no! <laughs> the herd is back! Yes, the spiders. The spiders have joined in! And the spiders will never attack the herd, though. Oh, wait, maybe they are now. I'm not sure. I wonder what this is doing to my performance. I can't get out of this! Press your bubble. I can't! It's on cooldown! Um, I don't know. 
Okay, I get out of here. I'll try attacking. No, okay, that's the wrong thing. I got one to go after, man. I'm not, I'm not sure how I can get you out of there. Too late. I still can't get out. Wow, really? Yeah, I'm stunned. Also, the be also the spiders are eating twelve stacks of meat. God, damn it! Go, 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 go! Whoa! Nasty why little crappers. Why is there a tentacle on that chest? A death worm. Hey, how come the beef floor are suddenly in heat? They randomly go into heat after a certain point. Great, now we can get them to fight the spiders again. Wonderful. Guys, there's a death worm on the surface. <laughs> That's a uh, Segway uh. monster. Yeah, he's eating like stuff. I just dug up a chest. Now he's fighting a tentacle. This is normal. This is okay. Oh wow, the tentacle actually killed it. I am surprised. But yeah, I was stun locked so hard I couldn't even heal. I'm surprised you lasted as long as you did. It's because I kept refueling my armor. Oh, okay. I, I tried attacking the beefalo, I just didn't seem to pull many of them away. Yeah, yeah gonna... it's because they all wanted me. They have a hard time shifting aggro. No, don't, don't attack me, attack the beefalo. Well, yay! I lost a bunch of junk. Besides the meat? Yeah, what I lost a bunch of meat and monster meat. Oh, we're, we're working on getting more monster meat. Yeah, but I'm still upset. I lost three stacks of meat. Yeah, that was a bit unfortunate. Because spiders can eat it out of your backpack from what it looks like. Looks like the spiders are getting a bit festy. Festive. Festive. Now the question is, what should we do with a buttload of spider? I mean, beefalo horns. Play them. Or make a bunch of flutes. There are two beefalo working on a spider den over here. Wow, they're really slow at it though. Let's see if I can get any more spiders out. Oh yeah, that did it. Alright, so I got the glaive. Haha! -ha. What a But yeah, Musha does 50% less damage. I doubt it. <laughs> yep. Wait. Wait, what? I noticed how the thing has durability. Does that mean it'll eventually break? It Once at zero durability, it just does zero damage. You can repair it with resources, like rocks. Ah. Uh, Jeez. Confusing. Time to get some more spiders. You need to keep those beef low working. <laughs> Wait, do you have a beef low helmet by any chance? No. Nope. Picking up some of this meat here might be useful to have one. <coughs> here. Oh, thanks. I just made one. Works I mean, for me. Gone invisible. Yeah, I suppose I have enough sleep or something, whatever it's called. Tired. How can you how can you turn sleep and tired into two different two different progress bars, two different meters? I, I don't know. It's not right. It's time to go knocking on some of these spider dens. There we go, that's more like it. Part of the herd, part of the herd, part of the herd. Part of the herd. 
The best part is now that evening is here, more of them will come out. It gives more opportunity for them. Cause a bit of damage. Because they will stay out too, right? Once you get some of these going, there's no, no turning back, really. Oh my god, they just steal so much of the food immediately. Yeah, they can eat an entire stack in a uh, few seconds. We might have to help them out here. Well, if you're not a, if you don't have a beefle hat, you might want. No, 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 no. We're helping. We're helping the beefle, not the spiders. Why? Because the spiders are gonna overwhelm the beefle. That's why. I thought that's what we wanted. Thought yeah, but I don't want it to be completely one-sided. Ah. As I've mentioned before, things need to be at least a little bit fair. I think the spiders are cheating again. They won't stop attacking. Well, they won't stop attacking me. They should be attacking these beefalo. <laughs> beefalo. I just remember. I just realized the flaw in our stars here. I have what? nothing. I have nothing to light up the area at night. I'm just grinding now. That's kind of you the point of the art. Or I can get destroyed by spiders. Ah, uh, it's not that bad. It's like, what, eight hits to kill one? I've been there, I've been there. Yeah, my problem is I can't even hit them at all. Really? Why not? I don't know, it's like whenever they're moving, it's like the I get the butterfly effect. It's because you're using heavy attacks, so you're moving slower when you attack- I mean, your attacks are slower. Oh. Wait, so how do I use light attack? Right click it. Right click it. The weapon when it's oh, equipped. That's kind of a pain to get used to. I yeah, suppose a little bit. You'll mostly only be ever using the light attack. Yeah. Back. There's a beast chasing me. Buffalo. What did I do with my- oh, there's my bunny hat. Okay. Time to pound in some doors here. No, no. Meet that. Okay. You can stop hitting me! Oh my god! Here. We're heading over towards the beef, though. Why are you killing my beefalo? I need them to kill spiders. There were so many spiders left. <laughs> you, we want to kill them earlier, so I'm finishing the job. For the most part. Now oh, that's a rather... One way, um... One dimensional way to look at it. There are a lot of glands here. That's okay. good, because we need them. To fuel our engines. Okay, I think I'm gonna try to kill some of these spider dens when I have the opportunity to. What the heck? Someone's items are broken. I don't think it's mine. Well, I needed a lot more meat anyway. Why the beef? Why the beef? Not the beef! Monster meat. 
That one's running in place. What's this? What happened to it? It got stuck. Are you seeing that? Yeah, it's because I struck it with slow. Oh, it must be like infinitely slow ah. then. It is so slow, it is the most slow. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> it's eventually moving towards me, but ha. Huh. That is really slow. Is how many are left? Three? No, there's more. Okay. One, two, three, five. four, five. Yeah. Okay. I mean, there could be more in the world. Mixing it up with some spiders here. Oh, they're all really slow, huh? <laughs> Only that one that's inching towards you. And that's actually going towards the spiders at this point. Because I'll add the spiders oh, next to it. Make that th we have less spiders in the world. I mean, deep low in the world. How many less? One. <laughs> A group of spider warriors all attacked them. If these spiders would just leave me alone for two seconds and attack that beefle instead, that'd be great. Alright, I got 11 XP. Nice. Yep. You only need 4,000 more for your level- for your weapon to be max level. Uh... It's not an issue. The game gets interesting even without being max level. <coughs> How do I get all the cool abilities that you guys have? Being at least level 5. By killing stuff! By eating, by killing. Uh, apparently that's two biggest ways to do it. I should pick up this food here. Don't also known as beef, monster that's meat. One of the last ones. Ah. Okay. That's one. Okay. Wait, there are two left. There's actually another one over here. There's three. Okay. Kill them. I, as long as there's one left, I don't care. I think we shouldn't even risk it because of the spiders. Really? A one den killed the entire beefalo. Thanks yeah, I, I want. Well, I want to get rid of the spiders too. Okay. Why is that one like? It's because I slowed him. Oh. Even I don't know how to slow stuff. It's a random chance with lightning. Oh, okay. There's static clung. Now what? Finish the spiders. Finish them. Finish them. There are a whole bunch of dens left. We should take them out. I don't have any armor. You don't need armor. You just need to refuel it. Your backpack is armor, soldier! Oops, I crashed. <laughs> oh no! No, they're all after me now! Time! I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Let's try this again. Or did you leave on your own free will? No. You're, you're supposed to carry me. The VOD will testify in my favor. Proof. Find a koala fin. There's a dirt pile here. Like fighting koala fins? You could. We could get you a bow, so you can easily attack it. It must be attacking you exclusively because I haven't been hit so far. And you decided to well, go berserker? Wait, right, so should I risk it? A random chance she just won't choose to eat food. No, she won't eat food above 180 hunger. Oh. Well, I'm not a berserker. 
Let's try this again. I'm still not a berserker. Okay, I'm gonna kill myself trying to become a berserker. Still not a berserker. Okay, apparently I'm not gonna be ever become a berserker doing that. So screw that yeah, idea. It's a rare chance, and I was lucky. I think I've had it once before. Oh, now you're tired. Yep. I took more damage eating monster meat than I did the entire time fighting. Blech. That's the ah. way it goes. Let's charge him up. Light him up, 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 light him up, up, up. <coughs> I don't have a bunny helmet, I can't see. You could get a lantern. We didn't get the bunny helmets until much later into the game. My lantern's on 6 Day 250 is when we got ours. And is that really it? Wow. Yep. All done. Well, I'm gonna wall back the base and pass out. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna pass out right here. I passed out right next to the campfire. Good job. I still didn't, uh. Just as I'm I. starving to death. Just as I had picked up the monster meat, it all turned into a big pile of four. I get the exact second. Oh look, I now have 90 health. I got something out of that. Yep. Spiders are best XP farm for Musha. Aren't, aren't we supposed to redeploy the nest? You yeah. could. Just make sure you keep them far apart from each other this time. This time? I, okay. Not, not you, but I mean, I'm the one who planted them really close like that. And the reason was because I wanted the, them to take out the beef flow. But the beef flow weren't really uh, doing much. They weren't in heat at the Me. time, but or they weren't by the time the spider dens grew up. So, the next thing is have. Oh, that beef flow is still really slow. Do we have the uh, resources required now to make a. The tree thing. The leaf Erickson. <laughs> Do you, how much beef flow will we have on you? Zero. Then no, we don't. Oh, it's all laying on the ground or what happened to it? <laughs> That's we only got fifty five beef flow wool. It takes sixty. You're kidding. How, does, <laughs> how did this happen? Okay. Bad luck. Five Just shave it. Sure shave the beefaloes before killing them. That would just make too much sense. So what really, what really should I prioritize right now? Uh, magic. Does that just mean level up? No, I just mean play Magic the Gathering. So there are a few useful items that you can get. Uh, if one of them is Musha's armor. is it? Musha's armor? Musha's armor is what he starts off with, remember. There's an upgraded... The Phoenix egg. There's an like upgraded the version. The Phoenix Egg is not really that useful as equipment or anything. So look yeah, at building the princess armor. Oh, uh, the princess armor raising, we can't make him. Why not? Do we have four Berger pelt lying around? Not at the moment. Do we have a buttload of green gems Wait, lying uh, around? Wait, mm. what about the iron cat helmet? We don't got the gears. How many gears does it take? Four. Yeah, uh, nice I've got three. I've got the gears for it. Draw, uh, Josh. Josh, I have four That's gears. We have four gears? 
Mm -hmm. and raising has it on them. I'll make it for you. If I can find the bones for it. There are 16 bone shards in that base. Okay. Or at least 10. I mean, there's some of your skeletons around. Oh yeah, right here is one. Oh, I found four gears. It sounds like oh. you don't need me then. Ooh. Also the spider... Oh wait, how old is this beefalo wolf stuff? I think that was... Wait, I have three here. Oh, then we have enough raising. I found some more beef. Woo! Long-term goals for the win. Woo-hoo! It's been a couple of I'm nights. I'm passing me it. Uh, it's laying here on the ground. Pick it up. I guess. Dunka. I'm still going down uh, to the ruins, I think. Just as soon as I make some food here. So I can finish that off. I can at least clear a path to the atrium. The I don't even know. What is the heart of the atrium called? The heart of the atrium? Yep. It's literally the most generic. Also, I need the glow dust. Okay. <laughs> you know, of course I would get two bone shards when I need three. You uh, only get two bone shards for hammering. Oh, don't uh, Now, there is another skeleton around here. But There's I some by the beef. Remember you might have I to kill someone. There? Oh, yeah. There's some in that savannah where all the beef died. Why did you turn the lantern on? Because that one's on 6%. Oh. Okay, I thought, for some reason, I thought you were a lead. Which would make less sense. Because he doesn't you need a lantern. See, you wanna see the tree? It better be a good tree. <laughs> Here's the tree! <laughs> okay. See, Saro? Why can I open him? <laughs> he is giant pet! Oh my god. Ah! Proceeds. He is giant pet! Proceeds to get swamped, swarmed, and killed by battleisks. Shortly after Raising, we make it. No. Raising, check how much uh, inventory he has. I opened it a little bit earlier. <laughs> why does he have so much? I don't also, even. Why does he look stoned? Why? <laughs> you talking about those eyes? Yeah, that's something else. I hadn't noticed that before because he was frozen. When he's frozen, yeah. the leaves cover it up. Or the branches, I should say. They don't really have leaves, they have needles. Yeah. Because he's a lumpy. So what exactly is it supposed to do? It right. does a lot of damage. What well, happens when it gets killed? It turns back into a fur egg. Oh, okay. I got oh. But it also takes zero damage when it's not in use. Is it making my sanity go down? No, okay. I'm pretty nope. sure it's because it's nighttime. Yeah. No, that's really weird. Why is my sanity going down so fast? Near me has a slight sanity aura. No, no, it's just like, but wherever I go, it's going down really fast. It must be yeah. something acting up. No, no, that's actually how normal, uh... It's because the, uh... The cat home doesn't count as actual fire, so that's why. Oh, really? Yep. How come I've never noticed that before? Because you never noticed it. Hmm. Also, there is another perk for, uh, Dao. You'll randomly spawn berry bushes around him. How random are we talking about? Like in a uh, one tile area around him, they'll spawn berry bushes, uh, glow, I mean, uh, light bulbs, and all other junk. They're not permanent, though, right? Correct. Okay. Once picked, they wither. And they can't be refertilized. So you have to tell him to move it, and he'll just make them despawn. I kind of don't get the point, because it's obviously a late game sort of summon 
And by late that, game... And he also does 400 damage a hit. Okay. I I'm just saying, I don't see the point of the berry bushes. You don't Probably need berry bushes. Immune to disease. Yeah, but they only have one harvest. Does it even matter at that point? Yeah, but if you tell him to move, he uh, turns them into the little summons, the little koboblins, and he moves them. So technically, you just could tell him to keep moving every time they wither. Wait, he how does he move a berry bush? Here, the... come over here, Raising. I'll show you how he moves it. Might have to wait until after the hounds. Oh, I was going to some, tell him to fight the hounds, but okay. Okay. Here, watch. <coughs> That's how he tells a berry bush to move. Oh, what how did hell? How did you force him to do that? F2. Oh. The tree's on fire! Is that even possible? He's a tree! Also, he look how slow me. he moves. I don't know, it seems about right for a tree guard. Yep. You don't think so? It, it makes sense. He would move as slow as anything. So, you have to use F2 to command him to do stuff? Yep. What a weird mapping. Eh. Like also, I've... look how slow I'm moving. Because you're tired? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, well. I think I have the food ready. So it's off. Well, maybe I'll just pick some more berries here. But yeah, I think he's more meant for like uh, moving your base. Like, due to how large his inventory is, I think he's meant for moving your base. Like reorganizing a chest or something. Oh, okay. Will he just sit there if you don't tell him to do anything? Correct. He'll sit there, damage immune. Hmm. So you don't have to worry about your base, I mean, him dying. Unlike Chester. Mm -hmm. Unlike Glomer. Yep. But what did I do with all my meat? Oh, I put it in the other. Yeah. What the? But yeah, <laughs> raising. You happy about having so much uh, meat in the fridges? Other than just a hundred monster meat? Wait, how much is there? Oh, it's about forty. Hey, <clears throat> I would so even be happy. I'd be happy for monster meat. Also, how many beefalo are left in this world? I don't know. Mm, okay. I guess I could check, but... Take a second. Beefalo. Eight. And last time we counted, there was like 40-something. I guess we did it a good job. What happened to my bundling? Oh, here it is. Hey, you can at least make some now, too. Yeah, the blue screen. Yeah. It was just that I knew I should have bundling wrap on me, but I didn't find any. Come on. See, got the nightmare amulet. I just need some stuff to refuel with. Maybe spider webs. Cause we have a ton of those now. Come here. Where were you? I feel pretty. There was a girls' night out tonight, and 
they were putting makeup on each other, and so now I look pretty. <laughs> Not that I don't always look pretty. Nice. I'm trying to decide if I want to paint my nails or not. That is honestly a dilemma I've never faced. <laughs> well, because it takes so long and it's already 8 or 9 p.m. Now, how long does it take? Uh, usually about an hour. Really? Wow. Because I put on multiple layers to make sure it looks good and it takes a while to dry. I'm amazed that people invest that much time in such things. I mean, I guess people can make the same claim about like playing video games, but there you go, raising you can have it. It isn't just video. Well, some people find that kind of thing to be fun, so yes, come in. Yeah. Okay. Wow, it's way over there. Uh, I actually took the wrong spot to get down here. Good job. Good job. Eh, it is what it is. Hopefully this is up in the savannah. I forget which one is which. If it's not up in the savannah, then I have to go back down again. And, hey, we are up in the savannah. Nice. Do you what? think you'll be able to solo fuel weaver with Musha? I, I think that's highly unlikely at the time. But <laughs> maybe with a little hey. tutoring from Josh with a W. Or from a West Main. How about a Wimpy Wolfgang main? Okay, back. We need to have somebody main Wimpy Wolfgang. Like, that's the challenge. You can't <laughs> ever go normal. You have to stay in your Wimpy state all the time. That would be some hell of a challenge. But at least it will be easy on the food. So what you could do is just have a mod that prevents Wolfgang from eating like past 25% or something. Also, Voila. uh, raising. My, uh, armor is now level 30. It's probably better than mine, then. 92%. <sighs> well, I mean... But now Claws can two-tap it. Really? He will kill it that fast? Wow, that's kind it's, of it's sucky. It's how high of its protection is. Well, enraged Claws. Rage. How am I prepare my stuff? You put rocks on it. It's like adding fuel to a lantern. Yeah, you can refuel it. Uh, rocks are not the only thing you can use to refuel it, but they're like one of the more common ones. You can use bee stings, <coughs> and you can use spider glands and spider webs. There's quite a bit you can use to refuel it. Alright, I've decided. I'm gonna do my nails. Yeah, because then you get to uh, hang around here. Okay, hold on, I gotta grab my nail polish. And tentacle is back. Oh, Josh left. Alright, for the last time I'm not Josh. I said Josh. I said Josh. I think maybe, maybe it's just a little bit of misplaced hostility. Uh, yeah. Do you have a problem with Josh? No. I thought I looked so good, and my boyfriend walked into the room, and he's like, "I don't like it." <laughs> oh, that's. At least, at least he's being honest, huh? Uh, top it off, I'm losing this Pokemon battle. I can tell I'm really tired in the game because I'm swinging so slowly. Oh, it's taking me twice as long to finish this battle now. I'm still getting in two hits, though. So that's the thing. Did everyone, anyone ever tell you you're supposed to smile when talking? Yes. Apparently it makes a big difference. Ugh. To me, I just find that creepy. 
Well, I was exaggerating it there, but... It, you'll notice a difference in the sound of your voice if you're smiling versus if you're just sitting there with uh, RBF. That's one of the things you're supposed to do if you want to be a broadcaster. What? What was that? What was what? I heard... I'm in the caves. No, no. From Discord. Oh. No idea. I think I have a lot of the Discord sounds turned off. I totally didn't leave and rejoin on my phone. Okay, you totally left and rejoined. <laughs> Screech! Screech! So there was one I thing. Can't keep falling down. This is annoying. There's one thing that's always annoyed me about, like when I've watched other streams, and that is when people have Windows sounds that leak into the audio for the stream, like the bing noise. Because you can you can turn those sounds off, and you really don't need them on at all. Um, I, I'd say that's about as bad as like having so, your phone uh, ring or something. What? What was that? No, I'd pretty much finished what I was saying. No, no, I I'm just talking about Pika. Sorry, I just realized I had my headphones muted, so I thought everyone just went deathly quiet. <laughs> And then we all go deathly quiet. Just the stupid phone screen making me hit random buttons when I put it down. Yeah, that's one of the things I could never, or the, one of the reasons I could never use, what is it called, Ray, uh, Wake on Rays or something like that, where you can pick your phone up and it'll supposedly turn the screen on. That feature has never worked for me. It's always turned on, but I have no intention of turning it on. So I just keep it turned off. I'm curious. Have, has anybody ever used that successfully? No clue what it is. Oh yeah, you don't have a smartphone. <laughs> okay. I do not own a phone in general. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's a bit unusual, but... I suppose you really don't need one, per se. Because you can do... says a smartphone? A phone that runs uh, an operating system like BlackBerry, Android, or iOS, I suppose. At least that's what I would consider to be a smartphone. We be tanking, boys. <laughs> Luckily, I got the other knight and rook trapped. So, I mean, it could be worse. Oh. Somehow, I unequipped my armor. That's always a smart, smart idea when you're in the middle of the runes, isn't it? Yes. Just simply unequip it. See what happens. Let uh, some of the clockworks throw you around a bit like that. Hmm, this is actually looking pretty serious. Whew. Hmm, <laughs> not today. So, does the durability of, like, my bunny helm go down when I get hit then? Even... Because I haven't... I've never looked at this before. So that, that would have... Basically what happens is it makes you lose your light source. Yeah, because when you get hit, it goes down a lot faster than it normally would when you're just using it as a light source. Yep. Wow. So it's a double-edged sword when you're fighting with it on. Yeah, sure looks that way. I'll have to be mindful of that in the future. Oh, yes, dangling depth, depth dwellers. Island. They're like the worst of spider kind. Hmm. It's the worst that the spider kingdom has to offer. Hmm, this is a very I interesting know place. An ant on my carpet. Where'd the bastard go? I killed it or something. 
Ah, uh, these rooks well, are so easy to fool. I noticed a lot of people think Charlie's gonna be the next event. Like a boss fight against Charlie, what do you guys think? That'd be, like, spoiling the end of it too soon though, wouldn't it? I mean, or do you think they'll create something after Charlie? I mean, there's still them in general, like the people who brought uh, everyone here. Yeah. Do you think that that might be where the story moves afterwards? So I just realized something here. With this extended range that I have, the rook cannot attack me for some reason. <laughs> I can just stand there and tank him and he will never attack me. It's because you keep, you're so far away that he can't get to you before you stun lock him. I'm not sure he's stun locked per se. It's like he keeps trying to get another bite, but he can't. That's really weird. I wonder if you could use like the cat whip for that or something. Because it has extra range. So which tankles the atrium? It has a little rabbit trap next to it. I, oh, are you down here? I can ping it. Yeah. Right. <laughs> now I just have to remember where it is. Uh, it has a lot of... It has a lot of green turf around it, and then a trap, I think. And it should be next to a green mushroom forest. Here it is. It's in the marsh. I actually, okay. Oh, wow. That's close to base. Is it? You gotta, like, jump yeah. through two different sinkholes to make it work. Uh, it's the base's sinkhole. Ah! Uh. <laughs> Yeah, this is uh, not going so well. No! Oh! What the hell? No, no! Leave me alone! Attack the bishops, you fools! I'm just gonna hide over here. But yeah, the sinkhole by base leads to that green mushroom forest. Oh, there's... There's a entrance in the green mushroom forest? I'm not sure about that. Yeah. Well, Which one? Where, where, where is it? Oh, okay. Yeah, I hadn't tried that one. I tried the one by the bunnies. So I guess I'll try the other one next time. And of course the tank pillar uh, respawns. They've been known to do that. Hmm. Jelly beans for the win, but then I have this problem. Can they walk through sanity gates? Yes. Because I thought walls would stop them. They don't anymore? Seems walls to me like... do, but sanity gates are not classified as a wall. Oh. That's too bad. I'm just wondering, like, what's the... I might just, uh... Ooh, that's a good question. How am I going to deal with multiple of them? Uh, oh, I think... I think they do count as a wall. They're stuck. Oh, they fixed it, then. They be stuck. They fixed it, then. I wonder if I can attack them through here. Okay, yes, I can. This is actually going to make it a lot easier. This is a great way to fight them. Because you know you can bolt, you can sync them up quite nicely. Oh, you might want to be careful over there. You're pretty close to where I am. Huh? Oh. Yeah, you might want to watch out. Okay. What? <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> I just telepoop over. Hey, a football helm. Hands up, I'm here to raid this place. Oh dear. Oh. 
The next big thing, I suppose, are the bishops. There are like three of them. Two of them. Okay, you just killed one? No, there's only two. Uh, then the spiders must have killed one. When I left, there were three. Oh, yeah, there's a third one that was off in the middle of nowhere. Okay. That explains it. Well, it's been a while since, uh... But they were all low. Really? I only attacked one, so... It must have been the spiders that went after the other one. Must. It's been a while since what? Oh, you haven't been around here in a while, I don't think. It's just treasure chests over here. Oh, yeah, dead end. Wait, do you have a lazy explorer or have you upgraded your phoenix glaive? My glaive. I just hit a wall a few thousand times. Oh. I think that should be fixed. Hey, it counts as attacking a monster. That's what I mean. That doesn't Why seem do you right. Have to repair the wall? Yeah, but and it's super grindy. Wait, hey, is there another way? Levels it up faster, you know. What kind of hokey deal is this? What? The way the map turned out here. Yeah, it's one of the dead ends in the maze. Here they are. We got imperfect generation, which can happen. I don't think we should try Fuel Weaver until we can at least beat Dragonfly with Musha. Yeah. I think we just want to clear out the area first at, at the most. Yeah, that's what we're working on tonight. No, 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 no. So many gatekeepers. Oh wow, now I'm really tired. I left my camp, my tent all the way back at the entrance. Did you see it there by Every any chance? Every time you say you're tired, I think you mean in real life. Nope, this character requires sleep. I know, I know. I know, it really uh, but, it's weird to me like, not I'm saying I'm so tempted it. to say, then go to bed. I'm already insane, so who the hell cares? Also, that's a dead end raising. Okay. Wait, you're insane down here? Yep. How did that happen? Oh, wow. Her weapon actually doesn't work if you're insane to teleport. Yeah, because it costs uh, sanity, right? Yeah, but the normal lazy explorer doesn't do that. Oh, really? Yeah, I guess it makes sense. That it wouldn't do it. So I like this one actually. What? This um, atrium. It's smaller than some of the other ones we've had to get through it. Sometimes they're really big. This one's pretty decently sized. Oh no! I'm really tired now. I'm going so slow. Wow, this is like the slowest of the slow here. Okay, I'm pretty close to the entrance now. But there are not even any spiders on the path. Wow. This is wonderful. Like, we don't have to walk through any spiders to get back to the tentacle. It's 
It's quite unusual. Okay, drop the rocks. And sleep in a tent. Orange gem, okay, and a uh, broken football helmet. Yeah, I don't even check the chest. Hey, I was only doing it for gems. You said you got one orange? Yep. I need, no, one yellow. Oh. Which, if we want, we can make that booty bag for no reason. I just thought of something that would be evil but fun. What? If my boyfriend and I switched bodies, I could paint his nails, and the body he'd be in wouldn't be strong enough to stop me. That depends. He could just be really weak. <laughs> oh yeah, raising. There is one perk for the, uh... The part chest I just realized. A good perk? You know how it spawns tentacles but has pathetic armor? I've heard, yeah. You wear really strong head armor. Oh. That I mean, way you still get the perk of the, uh, what's its name? Go ahead and also, try it then. You could just pop the shield. What the? How did I become instantly insane? Oh, that's why. Stupid keyboard shortcuts. That's precisely why I put on the, uh... Oh... Why?! I killed these things in the atrium! Did two double spawn? Maybe. Cheeky little buggers! Did you want to make the pirate thing then? Eh, possibly. Due to the fact that if, uh, due to the fact that it would actually be kind of useful for a boss fight if you think about it. Ooh, level 12. Oh, I that's why you, you were doing more damage raising. You had critical strike. Where did that come from? Critical strike. You gain more damage. Wait, what was the other key for that stuff? K? Yep. See? Critical strike three. Oh, Critical yeah, hit. Decent chance of doing double damage. Oh. Electric sh How do I level that stuff up? Leveling yourself. What is Valkyrie? Your R. Oh. Your, your lightning. Hmm. Electric shield, 3 out of 5. I would just wish you'd keep it on the screen. Critical hit, 3 out of 7. It double damage is it. On the screen as long as a chat message. How do I get double damage? Level 30. Oh, okay. 7,000 experience. Valkyries. Berserk, 1 out of 3. Sleep, wake up, 1 out of 1. I guess you always get that one, huh? Yep, you start out with it. Well, I see now, it tells you which skill these are for. Like, Hide and Shadow, it says G. Music is X. Spark Shield, C. Yeah, I think I pretty much have used all of those. Huh. Yep. Yeah, the reason I say that, go ahead and... Wait, I didn't want to jump into there. <laughs> the reason I was saying to go ahead and uh, try out the pirate backpack thing is because... Um, like, I probably won't be playing Mush again for a long time, so, like, once the server's done, we'll be bidding her goodbye. Can we do Trainer Red as the next mod? Wait, what's... Oh, is that the Pokemon one? It adds in Pokeballs to that function. If you decide to play him... Consistently. Yes. Then I, I can. I will. 
Okay. I won't. I probably won't it's play them. So much fun. But I'll. I'll enable them. Other characters can use the pokeballs too, though. Gotcha. It's just red has. Is I. Better with them. I'll be playing Wes. <laughs> oh, I, I, no. I need. I need to acclimate back up. To being more powerful. It's less than probably. Uh, I don't know. Maxwell. Wendy. I just think West Wendy because then you know you're losing not as much hunger when you're Wendy compared to West. Okay. I hope you know where you're going because I sure as hell don't. Yep. Okay. Just playing follow the leader here. Oh no. Is this the way out? Yep. Do you know the way? No! Why? <laughs> yes. I do know the way. I am the queen. Uh, oh, is that thing even still... No! It's not relevant anymore? Correct. Just to make sure I was double berserker, I decided to go ahead and eat some monster meat. <laughs> Well played. No, I messed up my nail polish. It's going to end. You need to watch more of those beauty channels. Shit, I messed up even more. I'm trying to get this toilet paper out of the bag so that I can use it to fix something. You double task too much. Alrighty. Hey, what happened I to you? Just die. I just ruined another nail. Now uh, I have to do three nails over here. Wait, did the game crash? No. There was nothing wrong with the game. Let's do Dragonfly. We should do Dragonfly. Before winter. We have nine days left. Let's do this. Are you back? Yes. Oh, okay. The internet just decided to come go kaputski on me. I see. I. But yeah, what do you think of the base structure thanks to, uh... What's their name? Oh, their name's so hard to pronounce. I just noticed that there are a lot of, like, super double spaces in it. Come double space. What? I think you're talking about double space? No, the, uh, the person who joined last night to yeah. organize the base. I just call him double space. Oh. Uh, because his name is a weird font? Yeah, it's like a font that's all, like, every letter is double spaced, but it should be. And it's cursive-ish. Ish. -ish. I don't know why Discord allows that, to be honest. Like, you, I've seen some really distracting usernames. It, and it, it, it looks ugly, it too. To, uh, ban yeah. Fortunately, That's I haven't had to deal with that one. yet. Yeah. See, people, smart people who do that makes it harder for uh, them to be kicked in this such. Why would it? Just looking up the uh, name. Oh. But Say if uh, they delete all their messages, and you don't have like a log for a who join. But the game, or I mean, the Discord has a log by default. I guess if you turned it off, then it wouldn't. But like, if we look at this right here, you know, it says West Serum is here. 
right? Mm, it never did on any of my servers. You must not have enabled the... No, it is. But it, the, it, Your server has to be up to a certain point for it to be enabled. It's just in general. Do, do you see the yeah. message in general? Wait, yes, wh what enables thing. it? The server has to have over 200 players. Really? Yeah, for uh, all the servers I worked on, it didn't announce it until we broke 200. Okay, let me just see here. I have... I have a stronghold server. And it has a membership log. Hmm, odd. It says Josh just joined. There are a total of nine people here. Then I guess it depends on the server because, well... I think you just failed to enable it. Maybe it depends on how new the server is. I just made this stronghold thing uh, a couple yeah, weeks ago. Yeah, like, my, my server that I've had for a long time doesn't have a log. I think you guys just not enabling it. There is a setting that you have to go to in the server settings for it. Server settings, uh, member, is it not members? It's audit log? No. Moderation. There's a thing for it somewhere. I think it's the boss. It says right here, it says new member message channel it's in the overview for the server can you look at your server once and see if it's there if you don't set it to anything i don't think it'll by default pick a channel but it might pick general new member message channel general yeah that's why i have it as uh then it should show the message whenever somebody joins the server well it doesn't and it's set to general I don't know why it's not working, and it should work. <laughs> it works for me. It's never not worked for me. Did you say uh, it didn't work for you, EU? It doesn't work for me, no. What? I don't... I don't get why... If the option is there, how could two of them both fail? Discord being butts? Uh... Could that be why? Try setting it to a different channel once. Like, I changed both of my defaults, oh. I think. Wait. Alien, um... Do you have two-factor authentication or whatever? Why do you ask? Because I didn't when I created my server and it... And it what? And it doesn't have that thing working. Oh, you're saying if two-factor authentication is enabled for the server or for your user account? I have no idea. I'm it's by user account. Up. It wouldn't matter by server. Yeah. I mean, when I created my server, I don't think I had it enabled either. I do now. I don't know if there was ever a change between the, those two time periods. Uh, I don't think there was. I think it, like, it always announced it, but... It was a while ago, so maybe I'm wrong. Could Discord just have been butts and change a lot of butts? I mean, I don't keep track of what updates they make, so it's possible. I only ever really looked at that at everyone thing because it was annoying. Are you talking about the April's f April Fool's thing? Yeah. It's because on some servers, people were spamming it, and uh, no one could do anything about it. Well, they played their user base quite well. <clears throat> yeah, because there was no saying to disable it. It reminds me, do you remember the event in Watch Dogs, I think it was, that EA implemented? It was basically supposed to be like a 4th of July for the United States kind of fireworks display. And people complained about it, like, being... The sound effects were very generic, repetitive, and kind of crappy. And there was no way to disable it. And since the game is sort of global, and apparently it wasn't localized for this, people who were not even in the U.S. had to listen to it. And it really ticked a lot of people off. And I think, like, EA said they weren't going to do it again that way. 
Or they had... But yeah, I think that was a couple years ago. Uh, when Watch Dogs 2 came out. I think. Could be slightly off on that. So maybe 2016? Dumb. But it reminds me of what you said here with Discord. Where... And I accidentally hid in chattel. But yeah, uh, I have crystal candy that you could use for uh, emergency health. We can fight DF together. We'll just tank. Hmm. Sp spank and tank? Yeah. We'd be more likely to win. Come on. Let's do it. What else do you need? I have a pan flute. Do you want to, to bring any? Oh, I have two pan flutes now here. I don't need two. And I have got like honey poultice and some food. So I'm. Uh, I'm gonna make some bacon and eggs for the fight. Okay. Just because food. All right. We'll see how this goes. Uh. Let us begin. Also, did you check out that music video? Uh, the one with the monster... Gorillas. Gorillas? <laughs> no. I forgot about it by the time I was done. Uh, was it an off topic? Yep. Wow, that's gonna be a ways away. I just searched for your name. Actually, it's not always away. It isn't? I scrolled up and it was instantly, like, after, uh, the, it was by Fivos' uh, flame post. It was yesterday, too. I'm looking. Okay, I found it. <clears throat> I'll wait until it's not streaming, for obvious reasons. Oh wow, dragonfly's way up there. Take the scenic route. She's looking for beta testers and she's willing to pay them. And signups are gonna start next month. And I wanna do it, but I can't seem to log into my PayPal account so that I can set it up to receive payment. Then just do it for free. <laughs> but I wanna get money. It's like ninety dollars in total, because she said thirty dollars per hour at it. And the game's about three hours long. Right. Who pays their beta testers? Like uh, even companies? even big companies don't do that anymore. Come on. Really? Well, do you know any big companies that have to, have to record their footage, both audio and visual? And then do what um, with it? And fill out, a, fill out a questionnaire and send it to her. Oh, you basically like and record a video of it and then send it? Yeah. Um, I mean, I should be I, I should become a paid beta tester then. I do that all the time. <laughs> I don't know if you're allowed to record your voice with it, and also... I have to reset my password because I tried too many times. Well, your voice is completely optional for me. And the, um... I forgot what I'm saying. Oh, PayPal, I hate you. All you ever do is double charge in the end. Ban me for not being 18 years 
I thought you had to be. I am 18 years of age. I can't freaking sign in. I, I thought that you had to be like 18 just to sign up for PayPal. You don't? Like, by uh, yourself. You used to not have to be, but oh. now you do, whether or not you have parents' permission. So they closed my account, and I'm like, thanks a bunch. Huh. You should use Bitcoin. No age. <laughs> no age limitations on that house. Okay. Do we want to wait till the morning then? Morning. Okay. Also, I have my music ready. You think we should use it? I don't even know oh, if mine's ready. Yep. Uh, See, it's above yeah. your head. Mm, okay. Wow. Talk about overlooking easy, th obvious things. <laughs> it's right oh. there. In regards to the sunglasses issue that I was talking not sunglasses issue the camera issue. Remember I was telling you about the little camera that I wanted? I did find a pair of sunglasses with a camera attached to them that you can take off. And that was the closest thing I could find. It was like twenty five dollars, I think. So we'll see where that goes. Those if it's the brand I'm thinking of, that's gonna be horrible video quality. Um, yeah. You mean, what do you expect for $25? And I mean, like, old, like, it would look okay on a CRTV, black and white, good. I don't know. Like, um, phone's bigger. But when you think about, like, the camera size, we need, like, a little gimbal. I want, like, a tiny camera you can just hang off the brim of a hat or something on a gimbal. That'd be great. I need a kickstart one. First, I'll have to learn how to build it. <laughs> but yeah, raising. You want to trade the uh, glaives? Why? So you, since you're better at dragonfly. We're just gonna tank, I think. Oh. Well, I was we're gonna try it that way anyway. I don't know. We'll see where it goes. Okay. That's how I usually do it on my server as Musha. Well, it's really hard to time it when... Holy, yeah! <laughs> what? <laughs> you, you forgot about these guys. These um, fuckers. they're always there. There's no point in, like, me, if she's hitting you. Yep. Now comes the hard part. I'm gonna try sleeping her again, okay, but I can't make any guarantees about it. Okay, it's one. I need a sleeper after she spawns the fourth one. Two. Three. Four? Are you kidding me? Holy ripperoni. Jeez. What the hell? Kill them? Oh, wait, no, she's spawning more. Yeah, it didn't work quite right, did it? I think the tentacles woke her up. Yeah, I think that's what was ruining me. The tentacles were wrecking me the whole time. Um, I'm actually in a bit of a pickle here. There we go. No, 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 no! What's going down? The bloody tentacles broke all my armor in a split second. Oops. Yeah, those tentacles are a bad idea. I'll own up to it. Terrible. Oh, look. Dragonfly into tentacles. Let's see where this goes. <laughs> How about that? A brawl is surely brewing! Get rid of Wilson, he's just annoying me. I mean... It's 
doing some damage, but she will leave once they get her down to a certain point. Wait, you have to call PayPal? They can't just text you? I've had issues with PayPal too, but it was mostly because I miss... I entered my birthday wrong. And so they went... They freaked out about it. And locked my account. Okay, she's spawning one. Zero, two. two. This time will be five. Three. Three. Four. Five. Play it. I'm in. Okay. Kill him? Yep. Oh, these little cheating scum. Actually, you only have to kill the very last one that she spawned. She's awake. Okay. Is this the very last one here? I can't figure She's out. She's spawning more. Spawn one more. Just one? Okay, we just have to kill that last one. I'm gonna try to. Just a second here. She'll enrage when I finish killing it. There, she's enraged. I gotta take some time to. I should have worn a thermal stone, I think. Too much heat, Jake. Jeez. Cool down already. Wow. Are you having this problem with heat as well? No, I'm not standing by the lava pools. Sorry. Okay. I need to help again. I was just like, you know, taking damage from overheating. <laughs> she froze. Papyrus. And jelly beans. So when she gets down to 20%, she'll start spawning again. This time will be one more. So you have to do it after six, pan flute. Uh, oh. What's that sound? Oh, she's really slow? Yep, oh she my god! Struck. <laughs> she struck. She's stricken worse than disturbed. <laughs> oh, the tentacles! <laughs> This Flaps. is gonna be great. <laughs> wow. Look at that! Look at that! Completely wrecked. <laughs> Look at that! What <laughs> was that? What was that? Now to retrieve the loot. Ow. Patience you must have. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> See, and you, you doubted my choice of using tentacles. <laughs> Got it we all? We were agreeing that they were annoying, though. Yeah, they are. Uh, they actually are what ruined me the first two times I tried to do this. Now that I think about it, that was exactly the same problem I was having. That was what happened most recently, uh, just tonight. Oh, boy. Hey, look, the rook knows! The what? The really? Of the, rook, the last one. Uh, you know, the funny thing is, we actually need this to do fuel weaver. <laughs> I'd forgotten that we needed it. Wow. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll put it on a trap next to it. There. <laughs> like what? What? <laughs> so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and kill all those tentacles over here. But I still find funny how the tentacles were basically like our saving grace. Yeah, they did help a bit. They for, at first <laughs> they, they ruined it. They did damage. Didn't they? Aren't they the ones who woke her up first though? Yeah. Yeah, so that's what ruined it the first time. That was the reason I couldn't solo. Because they woke her up right away. When I was yep, trying to do it by myself. Hey, we were able to do it as a duo. Yep. And hopefully partner. next next season I can try it again once I get oh my goodness, these meats are all going bad. I should put them in the frog oven. I live it. Okay. But yeah, I only popped sleep 
I mean, I popped music because it kept me from going tired throughout that entire fight. Oh. Really? Also, it regenerated my mana. That's how I was able to smite so much. Uh, I lost... Well, my sleep is down to 82, I guess. Didn't take that much of a beating, but I might not have been fighting quite as much, so... I was face tanking like you said to do. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> Put the frog oven out. <laughs> the hand was like, this is not my fire. I have to say, the one issue that I have with the finder mod is when it's night out, you really can't see whether or not a chest lights up. It's tempted to go down to the runes to clear it a bit more. Of what? More of the site. Oh. Okay. Wow. What? I'm just looking around. What is there left to really clear? Oh yeah, I said I was going to do the raid trap. So that might take me 30 minutes, we'll see. Oh. What do you mean? I thought the reed trap was already clear. Tentacle trap, I mean, and for the dragonfly. Oh. When you said reed, I was like, reed? Well, yeah, because I think of reed traps as tentacle traps. Mm. Probably shouldn't, but oh well. Ooh, no. But yeah, I just remember there being a lot of statue green gems down there, so that's technically why I'm going down there. You're going into the runes? Yep. At this point, it's much safer going in there as Musha than Maxwell. <laughs> 135 health. <laughs> yeah. That's nearly... That's actually o over double Maxwell's. Yeah, we've come a long way since we started playing this like three weeks ago. Yeah. We went from baby characters that couldn't really fight all too much to somewhat decently powerful ones that can duo a dragonfly. We went from basic to ASIC. I'm actually amazed I didn't need to heal any of us up with the flute. Really? I had tons of I healing on me. Yeah, that's what I meant. I was loaded for bear. Speaking of which, he still hasn't spawned in one room. Takes 11 arrows to kill one. It's because at max level, the uh, bow only does 50 damage. I mean, 25. Okay, then. How do I regenerate my sanity so fast? Mm. All of a sudden, like, I have this ton of sanity. Is your stomach full? Okay, I'm looking at it right now. 23. Oh, I bet that's what it's from, then. No, I just went up to 40. 140 from killing a tentacle. That's like 20 sanity. Wow, that is ridiculously OP. <laughs> Why is it so much? You gotta realize, you'll be using a lot of sanity for lightning for all that damage you want to be putting out. You're just not using her abilities. Okay, here we're at the lightning again then. See. Spam down lightning. Every time you hit R, it can charge up another strike. Yeah, I got. I uh, killed one in six shots that time. Yeah, and she also has a stronger uh, sanity penalty from mobs. It's still not using any of. Her sanity, or I'm killing so fast it's not even impacting it. Oh, 
Also, someone died down here and gave this uh, monkey a wig for helm. How considerate of them. Yep, so, uh, because Nightmare Cycle, it took me even longer to kill the monkey, monkey, monkey. Yay. Monka, monka, monka. monka monka. Maybe I should have forget about the bow. Till you have double damage, because that 50 da range damage is nice. I mean for killing these tentacles. Ah. Uh. That was the reason I was using it. Holy yeah, she has a heavy sandy drop. From what? I was down in the ruins. I had full sandy. Right when I uh, started fighting a nightmare creature, and went down to zero. Why does she do that? She has a higher sandy drain. When fighting shadow creatures? It's the ruins, darkness, plus uh, other things. Well, I mean, it's the... I was I was in the atrium and my sanity was fine. Were you fighting uh, shadow creatures while by uh, nightmare lights? Um, not exactly, but there were nightmare are those pillars that drain your sanity faster. The nightmare lights have minus forty sandy aura. What do the pillars have? You know those broken kind Zero. of ones. No, they have a sandy aura as well. Let's look it up. The obelisks. Yeah. What are the obelisks? Sandy aura. I guess I was buying some of those. Oh my god, this wiki is killing me. It's slow. No. The garbage search bar always deselects itself. So I load the site up, I click the search bar, I start typing in like two letters and it deselects the search bar on me, so I have to click on it again to keep typing. It's such nonsense. I can't believe wiki allows us to stand. The only reason I like Wikia better than uh, Gamepedia is because B Gamepedia has this idea that stretching the entire thing out to the width of your desktop is apparently a good idea when it's really not, which makes it difficult to read anything because you got to trace your head back and forth reading the whole thing, right? Like, it needs to be centered in the middle of the screen when you have a wide screen, and the Gamepedia does not do that. So, like, that that's why I would say Wiki is still superior if you have Adblock. I don't know. With how Adblock, it can be pretty miserable. Um, they, they're just like really overboard with ads. Yeah, it's because of, they need ads to support the site since it's horrible. From yeah, but see, what, ha what ends up happening is like, I'm okay with ads if they're not intrusive, but when you're constantly auto-playing video off to one side, you redirect your site to like some stupid Amazon giveaway, or you have um, pop-ups, I think pops are less likely now if you have browsers, but it, those are the kinds of ads that will cause me to turn on an ad blocker, and then you aren't getting anything from me in terms of advertisement. It just you know keep the, the ads keep them nice. Yeah, but when you have that one little kid who doesn't know what ad blocker is, well, boom, you have a lot of money. I I just think that's a failing model to adopt. Why would you do that? Ha ha! Oh, that was nice. Give me some good old fashioned delay there, huh? I mean, to be fair, killing tentacles here with Musha is easier because she's got a weapon with longer range. Yeah, this will work, will work, I think. My gosh, Dwash, why did you leave so much junk down here to, for me to kill? He didn't clear out the runes? No, he said he. Oh, I'm just gonna go down there and harvest stuff. 
He leaves clockworks, those spider things, and all other hell down here for me to kill. I had no idea. I thought he liked doing that kind of stuff. I'm surprised he left it. It's because he doesn't have much time. Yeah. He said he won't be on for the rest of the week because of that. Gem. You don't even need a lazy explorer though. What are you planning on using it for? Nothing. Oh. I mean, it's nice you have them. In case someone else who isn't Musha decides to come and play. Yeah. I gotta can't do both at the same time, obviously. So you only gain experience when you actually kill something. Yeah. So fighting these tentacles here is not giving me a lot of experience. Yeah, that's why spiders are best. I think I should just like, base it off of the HP of the thing you killed. Because yeah. then you'd get a lot more XP from killing things like Dragonfly. And it would incentivize you to go out there and do that. Right? If you got a lot more XP from killing Dragonfly, it's a clear way to level up. Compared to killing spiders, and it's less grindy too. Like, if you're good, and you're like, yeah, I could grind spiders, but I'm good enough to kill solo dragonflies, Musha, and I can get a lot more XP that way. I just think that would be more rewarding. Yeah. It would be nice like that. Well, if I passed out in the ruins. I'm down to 48 here, fighting tentacles. I'm at 8. I mean, it could be worse. I have bishops around me. Uh, it's slowly getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> and the slow, and those d dangling whatevers or whatevers, the things that shoot rocks. Shoot rocks? Yeah, the ones that shoot rocks, the spiders that shoot rocks. Oh, the spitters? Yeah. I think it's supposed to be like a web that they spit at you. It looks more like a rock. Well, it's like a little ball of web. Right, what kind of. Wait, this is only 58% armor reduction or damage reduction. What, your bunny helm? Yeah. Took the armor off. Mine is 80. Oh my god, this lag is just so killing me. It's not even funny. It's all the hell that's going. Oh, I've lost connection. I had like a buttload of mobs that Josh left down here because he was hammering altars to farm fool site. So why did you get disconnected? My game decided to say I had too high of ping to play. Oh wow. Yeah. It said this server is only connecting, uh, is only allowing people with uh, very fast internet. Did it log that at all? For me it said that that's what happened. Wow. 
I've never actually seen that message. Something went wary while connecting. I mean, the server's still up. Probably my internet's just too slow. Are you experiencing a hiccup? Yeah, it's saying I can't connect. Uh, let's see here. It says closed with reason. ID DST user connection failed. Huh. I'll try eh, try restarting Steam real quick. Because Steam has been being a butt all day. It's been putting me in offline mode a lot. Offline mode? That happen to you? Yeah, usually it's because my internet connection's getting knocked out. Blech. I know, like, it fails to recognize when it's reconnected or something. That's what I've seen anyway. Yeah, and it, Steam is refusing to start off. Oh, so it looks like it is a problem with your connection then. Or it's not starting at okay, all. Okay, now it just loaded a hundred page of Steam news. Oh, it's Barger. Barger. It's the big one. Well, at least I got some of my <laughs> some of my tiredness back. I'm gonna go invisible here and try to pick this stuff up. But yeah. <laughs> I got a lot of meat. Meat. Yep. It was faster doing it that way, I think, compared to the bow. Because hmm. with the bow, I always had to pick up the arrows back up, and that was a nuisance. Yeah, it's not letting me connect still. Well, that's too bad. Uh, I mean, it's 1016, so. I'll probably log off at the same time, but if you wanna quit now, I understand. Yeah. Save Berger for another time. Oh, I'm ready for Ber Berger. He's not gonna get away with this. You're gonna punch that Berger in the face? That's the plan. We're done talking. We're done walking. You think he's spawned already? Mm -hmm. I haven't heard him since, and it's been a while. Maybe he's just gonna spawn on the last day, like every day. I heard him. Okay, I'm gonna count for him. No, there are no barriers in the world. Okay, well. And I guess I'll just go back to killing tentacles. Do you think the caves could be forked, maybe? Yeah, maybe. has happened before, but that was with rollbacks. I mean, I was fighting a buttload of spitters and useful monkeys. I wish Berger would just spawn like a normal Barrager. So many times we deal with this.
Yep. Dirty rot, no good lag got me there. The thing is, I press, I press the space bar to attack, and it takes like half a second for the character I'm controlling to start homing in on the attack. And that's just too long for tentacles. Like, this is what's really touchy about tentacles. Especially if you're playing like a different character. I have a lot of Liba here with Musha. But as another character that had a shorter range weapon, I get slapped around like crazy. Uh, as a matter of fact, I'll try it here. We can just get a tentacle spike. This means I'll have to get in closer. I mean, I'm doing okay, I guess. Well, except for that. Yeah, this is taking longer. <laughs> the, the tentacle spike does less damage. Quite significantly. Yeah. So there's no point in using it, even like to help practice with like a more normal weapon. Cause I was, oh, I hear Barrager again. That was kind of the reason I was doing it. I figured, hey, this will help me get the feel for it when I'm using a different character. And I want to solo some tentacles. Like if you're playing Wicker Bottom or something, I'm gonna go out there and harvest some tentacles, hopefully get some spots. It uh, helps to be able to kite them without just taking a ton of damage. Well, hopefully there will be a feast waiting here for Barriger. It's a lot of monster meat. You gotta poison them? Kill them with kindness. Oh my god, three of them? What are the odds? They, d yeah, they hit us. They hit us good. That's a problem too, like, y you get into a flow of being able to kite like three. But the minute that you press something and it doesn't work like it should. The whole timing is off. And you are done for. You take all the hits. Now what's gonna happen if they're just packed too close? So the really interesting thing is even though I've been out here fighting them this whole time, I still haven't lost any of my sanity really. Even though it's going down like crazy, the amount that I make for winning or for killing a tentacle is just so amazingly high. I make it all back.
I know we're near the base, so we shouldn't spawn over there. Yeah, that's not gonna work at all. Holy crap. Those are just too close. Okay, we're gonna use the bow for this then. I really just like how the bow did just decides to never use the arrows by default. That's really annoying. Like why would, if I have arrows in my inventory, why would I ever not want to use the arrows? It's because it was originally switched to uh, sword after you run out of arrows. I hadn't run out of arrows. I had 34 in my inventory. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Still no bear germ. I wonder if it'll be a bug to bear Jer once again. That one other year, we heard him going on for like an entire season before he ever spawned. Oh, Musha. You disappoint me. More importantly, I guess it's just a game that disappoints me here. Performance just uh unresponsive. I just want to finish clearing out this tentacle field, and I'll be happy.
Got nailed again. Same problem as before. Lag. <laughs> you did me again. Like I'm pressing, I'm pressing the button. You do nothing. You can sort of compensate for it by pressing it sooner than you absolutely would have to. And I think I got them all. <sighs> so that tentacle area is done for. We can all celebrate 1031. I'll be saving in just a moment here when morning comes. Okay. Did you try connecting? Yeah. And still was refusing you, huh? Yep. Something well wary when connecting. <sighs> the last time I saw that, I think it was... Um, is there any way I can kick you out? Or like, despawn you? Because now I am getting worried. Maybe we should have corrected this before. I'm not sure we can roll back enough now. I suggested that, but... Well, I thought this was just going to be a simple case of your internet being bad, not necessarily the game. Okay, uh, I'm going to save once here, and then I'm going to try restarting it. It was uh, 20, I mean, 18 minutes ago. Yeah, there'll be like a couple saves back. So what I'm planning on doing here is just restarting it once and seeing if you can connect then without me being on it. And then I might have to roll back past that. Sorry about this. Uh, it's, I don't think it's your fault. I think it's just the caves being the caves. Yeah, it's probably an issue with it because it's modded. Mm -hmm. That does it for the stream. Thank you everybody for watching and I'll